If the automobile market were a neighborhood potluck, Toyota would always be invited. It may not always serve the spiciest or most interesting dishes, but what Toyota brings to the party usually satisfies the masses. And the refreshed 2017 Highlander and Highlander Hybrid are the baked chicken and mashed potatoes of the automotive world. For 2017, however, Toyota has added a bit more spice to the recipe in the form of more powerful and efficient V6 and hybrid power trends, while also updating the popular SUV's styling. It even cooked up a new variation in the form of the Highlander SE. The Highlander's newfound style starts with a redesigned front end, with rearranged headlamp innards, including curved LED accents on ASE, LTD, and limited platinum models, and perhaps the widest grille outside of a Peterbilt. All Highlanders use new LED tail lamps, while limited and platinum models add chrome ringed reflectors to their bumpers. The SE model looks more sinister, well, as sinister as a Highlander can look with darkened body accents for the grille, headlamp surrounds, and roof rails, along with 19-inch wheels. Interior changes are less obvious. All models now have a 4.2-inch color display between the gauges as well as a slew of USB ports, 3 in front and 2 in back, enough to satiate numerous smartphones and tablets. Top Shelf Limited Platinum Models sport new faux wood trim, while SE models instead use accents with a dark technical pattern. All models except for the SE now can be ordered with 8 passenger seating, meaning a second row bench, the SE must make do with 7 seats, its leather-covered captain's chairs adorned with a striped ribbon in the cushions. At least as appealing to the Highlander's family totem clientele, we suspect, will be the standard fitment of the Toyota Safety Sense driver assistance features on all versions. This includes adaptive cruise control, forward collision warning with pedestrian detection and automated emergency braking, lane departure alert, lane keeping assist, and automatic high beams. Blind spot monitoring comes on all but the Basla. The other news for the 2017 Highlander involves its engine, Toyota's port and direct-injected V6, known by engine code geeks as 2GRFKS. It brings an extra helping of horsepower and improved fuel economy to both V6 and hybrid models. The V6, now common to hybrid and non-hybrid models, is capable of running the Atkinson cycle, although the hybrid uses the more efficient engine cycle more frequently. All produce the same 295 horsepower at 6,600 revolutions per minute and 263 pounds to foot of torque at 4,700 revolutions per minute, increases of 25 horsepower and 15 pounds to foot of torque over the previous V6. The hybrid's front and rear electric motors bring its total system output to 306 horsepower, versus the previous 280. The availability of the hybrid also is expanded to the LA and XLE in addition to the pricier limited and limited platinum trims. It are four-cylinder engine with 185 horsepower and 184 pounds to foot of torque carries over unchanged with front-wheel drive only and a six-speed automatic transmission. Only 7% of Highlanders are sold with the four-banger, according to a Toyota spokesman, and that take rate is bound to drop further with the introduction of the improved V6, especially given the four bangers' disappointing fuel economy of 20 miles per gallon city and 24 highway.